So at this meeting, I also have the opportunity to present the updated results of the uh, dose expansion cohort of patients with relapsed or refractory diffuse large B cell lymphoma who were treated with odronextamab following CAR T cell relapse. Um, so the we know that CAR T cell is an effective treatment for patients with diffuse large B cell lymphoma, though unfortunately the majority of patients will ultimately relapse. And we know that for those patients the prognosis is poor, so this is really an unmet need. In this study, uh, the ELM-1 study, uh, we looked at odronextamab, which is a CD20, CD3 bispecific antibody in patients with CD20 positive non-Hodgkin lymphoma. In the phase one portion of the study, which has already been published, the doses of odronextamab were established for different histologies. And now, in this portion of the study, we performed a dose expand, looked at a dose expansion cohort, specifically in patients with diffuse large B cell lymphoma who had relapsed after CAR T. There were 46 patients who enrolled and 44 who were available for response. Uh, we found that the overall response was just under 50% in these patients and the CR rate was approximately 30%, which is encouraging for this high-risk patient population. The median duration of response has also not been reached and the probability of maintaining a response at 12 months was 61%. The uh, odronextamab also appeared to be well tolerated with uh, rates of CRS which were similar to uh, that seen in the phase two study which was around 50% and all cases were grade one to two. So overall this is a promising uh, treatment strategy for patients who relapse after CAR-T and uh, is an exciting option to have for patients.